so I'm finally happy to add two more updates. Uh, those are the running or the flying kick and 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 the stomp by the enemy. Let me just talk about the first update, the flying kick. Uh, many of you complained about the, the first prototype that I uploaded a few weeks ago uh, of the character not having an attack while running. So I added this move. Mm. I was thinking what would make sense, which animation would make sense uh, when you press an attack button while you're running and this running or flying kick made a lot of sense to me. So I added that. And let me just kick an enemy right here, a dummy enemy that I created just for testing. Okay, it's the exact same particle effects, the same camera shake. Uh, I'm not focusing on the particle effects for now. I'm just focusing on the, the very basic character movements and combos, the, the core stuff, basically. Mm, I'm also thinking about moving the enter button uh, into the mouse left click because I, I didn't put into consideration that many people don't really have a gaming or mechanical keyboard where if you press four or five buttons at the, at the same time on a keyboard, most normal keyboards don't register uh, the fourth button. Uh, so you need a gaming keyboard if you have five or six different buttons that you need to, you need to press. So I'm thinking about having instead of the enter button as the attack, I'm I might put it into the left mouse, cl mouse click or something like that. And then I might add another layer where the left click might be a punch and the right click might be a kick. Um, I'm just thinking about it. Let me know what you think. Because uh, it's just not, I just don't think it's too old school to have most of the buttons on the keyboard like the DOS games used to do. I'm, I'm thinking more of like a, the, the Rocket League control scheme where part of it is controlled by the keyboard, part of it is just from the left click or the right click. And let me just now talk about the second update, the stomp. Certain enemies will have this ability, certain enemies will not. It will just be added as a challenge. I got the inspiration from the old school MMA days, back in Pride days, um, Mauricio Shogun Hu, I used to stomp on everybody and knock them completely unconscious. Like, you don't see that in the UFC anymore. Um, but Back in the Pride days, people used to get knocked out silly from be, being kicked in the head or being stomped in the head. So that's where I got the inspiration. Let me just show it to you again. I like it because it looks painful. And um, I'll ha I'm, I'm just happy that I'm adding more and more animations, more and more attacks, and they'll be all put together um, to form a challenging game, I guess. We'll see what happens. So that's it for today. Let me know if you have any questions or comments, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.